Space Systems Command celebrated the first anniversary as a U.S. Space Force Field Command. The day's events were kicked off by a group of local students attending a STEM event here at SSC where they built miniature rockets from common materials, then went to the soccer field where their rockets flew up to 100 feet in the air. The youth activities were part of SSC's STEM outreach program, led by Director Nicole Palmer and Deputy Director Jonathan Stroud. So today we have this awesome STEM activity, as you can see. We are building rockets out of paper, um, and we are going to go outside to the soccer field, and we have a pneumatic launcher, and we are going to shoot them in our soccer field. So STEM education, which stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics, it's so important um, to bring our youth and to bring our awareness and education of all the STEM activities, STEM careers. Um, as you can see, they're quite young here, so we're not talking so much about careers right now, but we want them to get enthusiastic about science and, you know, what more fun to do than to launch a rocket. There's some studies out there that say kids in fourth, fifth, sixth grade, somewhere in there, they have decided whether they want to go into a STEM field or not. It's not really fair if they don't know of the opportunities they have in STEM. After the STEM kids conquered space, or maybe low Earth orbit, SSC leadership and personnel came together for an enterprise-wide town hall hosted by SSC Commander Lieutenant General Michael Gutlein. Lieutenant General Gutlein shared many of SSC's top milestones and achievements since the command was established one year ago to get ahead of and to counter the increasing threats in the space domain. Lieutenant General Gutlein also shared SSC's new mission video, available now on SSC's public website, telling the world about the congested and highly contested space domain and SSC's role in providing assured access to space and unity of effort across government agencies, commercial partners, and allied space providers. The youngest member of Team SSC was joined by the most senior to cut the anniversary cake with ceremonial sabers, then the celebration moved outdoors to the Shriver Courtyard for a group photo and some adult STEM activities where the kid and all of us had a little fun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Boom. Reporting from Space Systems Command in Los Angeles Air Force Base, I'm Peter Aninos.